so here we are guys we finally hit four percent again which means that more developers are going to be interested in the linux ecosystem and they are going to develop their apps for linux too now this is a win for linux we are at four percent again we've reached four percent one time but now we are four percent again finally 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 but i mean i expected to get to four percent again and to even higher numbers because a lot of people are switching especially from windows they are getting tired of all the spyware all the bloatware and all the ads and they just want a clean operating system that they can use without spyware without bloatware that they have control over that they can personalize actually and linux is the only choice and I mean it's not the only choice because you have a lot of distros but it's always Linux which is good because Linux is good Linux is a good operating system especially in these last years it has developed a lot it has got a lot better these last years and I think that Windows users that are switching are a big part of the increase of these numbers like myself I got interested into Linux on like the end of 2023 because of windows i got tired of windows and all the crap that they were putting into the operating system and i was like okay let me check linux let's see how it is let's see how it's going and it's going good it's going good now it's not a perfect replacement for everything like a perfect replacement of windows but it's okay like it's not a linux problem it's it's just the developers that have yet to develop and port their apps to linux it's not like a linux problem so yeah but overall linux has gotten pretty good recently and i remember like two years ago people were saying oh my god hdr will never come to linux and now we have hdr on linux like all of these things are coming together and linux is becoming a mainstream is starting to become more and more mainstream in a good way okay we are already at four percent which is tens of millions of computers like it's not a, a, a small number like four percent is a very very big number and if we also count the two percent of chrome os we could say that we are at six percent and also we have this unknown section here from stat counter which i mean doesn't tell you what operating system this is it's just unknown and i could say that i'm pretty sure that it has some windows 7 users but also i'm pretty sure that it has a lot of linux users and so we're probably at more than four percent like this site is not 100 percent correct also because of the unknown category so we could say that we are at more than four percent but let's stick to four percent it's already a pretty big number it's already a good number the maximum that we've reached is 4.05 so we're literally a 01 less than the, the whole time high and if things continue to grow and they will next month we will surpass the all-time high again also i think that somewhere in the future linux will hit 10 percent i think that when linux will hit 10 percent i would say that most if not all the applications will be compatible with linux natively too like now you can run a lot of incompatible apps with linux with wine but i think that native builds are the future like wine is an awesome project especially for gaming when we're talking about like photoshop uh, adobe products and fl studio and other proprietary stuff i think that the best way to run them is just with the native build so that we can have less bugs hopefully and so yeah that's about it i hope that linux will continue to grow and it will because linux is a good operating system and people are noticing that so it will grow it will hit 10 percent someday and when the day will happen well will be mainstream so yeah see you in the next video